Hello guys, welcome to the first video of this channel, Garden Noob. <laughs> so we're over here. As you can see, we had a lot of snow recently. Um, so I'm in the middle of winter. I'm in zone 6B. I live in Pennsylvania. So here are the uh, trees I have right now and plants. Starting with this. Uh, this is my Hobbit Jade. Um, it was looking really good, uh, and it's still, it's still pretty okay, pretty decent, but we haven't had that much light recently, that much sun, it's been, uh, quite cloudy. Uh, so, today I woke up, and I saw that it dropped all these leaves, uh, just in one day. Uh, I checked the soil yesterday, and, um, it was, uh, pretty dry, but, you know, I like to let it dry. Um... In between waterings so i think i let it dry too much i think that was my mistake uh but now i know uh, i still have some good foliage left so hopefully i'll manage to keep it alive until spring so moving to the right here's my little seedlings for uh i think these are alberta spruce if i'm not mistaken i know it's kind of a kind of on like weird and not a good idea to grow other to uh, to grow seeds during the winter because there's not a lot of light uh, most days and it gets quite dry inside here because of the heaters um but i did it anyways you know it was it was a pretty cheap kit from uh target it came in this little can uh, i made some holes at the bottom and put some uh, rocks for drainage so that's that. And then here's my Molsai <laughs> I got from Home Depot, which uh, in hindsight, I don't think it was a great idea, but either way, it's a, a ficus tree, I think it's called. Um, and I got this from, as I said, from Home Depot. Uh, it has some, it has a nice trunk, you know, uh, it's okay. <laughs> I'm just trying to keep it alive, basically, I'm not really planning to do much with it uh so just planning to keep it alive as much as i can um then in the spring i do want to you know when i prune off maybe cut about right here that branch or something like that uh and then replant it try to spread it and make it an actual uh, figus tree because as you can see this one was chopped off right there, and then a little branch was put in there. Um, either way, yeah, that's the ficus tree. Now, this is my uh, elephant bush, uh, also called uh, mini jade. These are looking pretty okay. They were uh, not looking that great, they were very leggy. I had them uh, in a spot where they didn't get full sun. It was a uh, north facing window and now as you can see it's on a south facing window uh so they're spreading pretty well i cut them a lot uh, i trimmed them back a lot because as i said they were very very leggy and i'm looking for i'm trying to make them you know have thicker trunks i think these are about um two years old two and a half years old um so yeah i'm just growing this for now as you can see there's some new shoots coming in even in the winter now uh we're in, they're not getting as much sun so that is great to see so now i'm gonna move downstairs and i'm gonna show you my two projects for uh bonsai that i'm planning to do uh once the spring hits all right so we are out here now by my front porch um and here's the one of my projects for spring it's an Alberto spruce I got for um, Home Depot, a uh, really good price. This can totally stay out here. They're in a dormant state at the moment. So I'm planning to do some heavy pruning and some wiring once the spring hits. One is a juniper, uh, mm, juniper nana, I think it's called. And I'm planning to do the same thing, uh, bonsai it for the spring. So yeah, that is gonna be it for now. Uh, thank you for watching my first video. If you want to see the progress of these plants, uh, please subscribe. I'm gonna be, you know, uh, making videos as they 
change and as the season changes and uh, as I try my uh, bonsai project with uh, the two plants you saw outside. So yeah, thank you for watching and uh, make sure you subscribe to um, see more updates on these plants. See ya.